All right, this is something I did. I took some of the uh, excess wood, some of the, uh, there was a short piece left over, and cut it into three different pieces. Now, what these will be is uh, it'll go inside the uh, planter box, kind of like that. Uh, if this was the side wall, they'll, they'll stick up a little bit. Not this high, but they'll stick up a little bit. And then that second planter box top will slide over it uh, on each side so that it, it locks it in. So you don't have to connect the two together. It just, this will lock it in as a post on all four corners. So I used the excess wood on the table saw and sawed those up to make those little posts. Now, if you don't have a table saw, what you're going to have to do is probably get some 2x4s, just a short 2x4 piece, and cut it in pieces about this big, which is uh, oh, about 12 inches, a little less than 12 inches by about an uh, inch and a half or something like that. Uh, but a 2x4 would work well. And we're going to anchor those in each corner of the planter box on the bottom piece and then slide that top piece over top. And it'll lock it in. You could actually keep going higher and higher with, with uh, things like this. You can make a composter um, with something like that. Just keep stacking them up higher and higher. But it's a good way to lock them in. Uh, and you don't have any additional hardware needed to uh, connect the two together except for a few more screws.